No, there were no screams. Also, this one does not have voice acting yet. It says that that's uh, not in the demo. So, um, it is coming soon. Um, a good girl's guide to murder. F fun! Um, and this is still, uh, not yet out, so... I mean, not yet out, but I mean, not even a release date yet. You are Bernard Thorne. Today you have returned from the hospital with the help of your daughter-in-law, Kate E. After suffering an accident a few days ago, your son Andrew could not visit you today because of his work, but promised to join you tomorrow. It is 4 a.m. now. Katie has left your, your house while you slept because of her night shift. You're alone. You decide to get out of bed. I think this is the one with the... War veteran? Yeah, Vietnam War veteran bound to a motorized uh, wheelchair. So I get to run over people. Press and hold. Okay. Water soluble pain pill. Sarah used to give me two of these. Tap the right to put away health items. Ew! Also, nice fuzzy. N not even anything. It was hold space bar to stand up, then release to sit in your chair. Okay, wheelchair. Fancy. Fancy, fancy. I'm guessing that's for uh, putting a book or something to read. Please don't tell me I can run out of juice on the wheelchair. I will be very disappointed with my going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Broken tablet. My old tablet. It broke when I fell down the stairs. Were you walking down the stairs or this uh, wheelchair is a new development? Did you break your leg? No. Diagnosis. Sunny Ridge Hospital Medical Diagnosis Dick Evaluation Form. Start discharge 4-29-2014. Bernard Thorne. Yeah, I've seen those, but I mean, it sounds like... Like, you have a... When you get into one of those, there's a seatbelt you sit into. So, he must have been... Okay, here, it, the answer. Uh, age, uh, Bernard, 73. Minor bruising from falling downstairs. Signs of minor memory loss, possibly caused by a concussion. Above norm nominal amount of codeine detected in blood system. Patient fell down the stairs along with his electric wheelchair backwards. Though signs of physical trauma are minor, there's a possibility of slight memory loss. Blood patient, uh, blood's te- Ugh. Patient's blood test shows a moderate amount of codeine, so it is highly advised to reduce the patient's pain medication dosage and look out for overdose symptoms such as shallow breathing and hallucinations. Oh, yay! Hallucinations! Also, um... Good that there's a bunch of people over here to see if I'm, uh, you know, overdosing on things, you know? Don't have a, a nurse here. Can I turn that on? Yeah. Touchy, touchy. Anything over here? That is an old radiator. It beams! I just realized it beams! Ah! <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm easily amused. Well, he fell backwards. Can I turn on the TV? Can I be an old person turn on the TV? And God, that's old. Does that have a tape player? The a VGS tape player, does it? I don't... Yep, it's down there. That's hilarious. Door remote. I can't reach it. I need to stand up. No, no space to stand up. Will it tell me when there's enough space? Also, they have locked me in this room. They have locked me in this room! No, he fell backwards. In other words, he was in his chair and did this. And then fell backwards. Oh, well, I mean, 
Yeah, it, it beeps in reverse. No, um... It says that he had a hallucinations, so... Uh, oh, it's an automatic... Why was it kept already on the... I mean, it's it, this is a tutorial, so it's teaching me how to do things. You can turn your even in place. Cool! I am Xavier. Bernard, your new tablet is being charged in Andrew's old room. I kept the room bright for you so you could uh, just need to go in and grab it. Why didn't you put it in my room? What? Is there no charger in my room? I feel like there's a charger if there's uh, lights. Um, good, that you, good that your name is on that. Something's blocking the door. A dead body? Sarcasm. I'll just ram it. But let me guess. It... There's a connection point somewhere else. Well, he is from Vietnam. Don't go near the light! Don't! Get up. I mean, I can't, at least for long periods of time, but okay. Do you think I have the arm strength for that? The answer... Uh, oh, we're, we're using... Okay. Th that is interesting, yeah. Hi. Hi, hand. No, I mean, I'm not saying I can't. It's just he can't. Some objects when you're directly in front of them, so I have to... Mm. I have to go up in the attic. Why, though? Okay. Need more pain medications. Yeah, we're not gonna overdose at all. We, how do I... Note. Important. Always keep the second floor corridor and the bathroom light on at night. Also, do not remove this post-it. I do what I want! Apparently. Oh! Look at that. The light's not on. Oh, okay. Okay. We are... We are, um... We're amnesia in this shit. By the way, this is also a widower, widower, so... Kate, signal is too weak here, so I'm just gonna leave post-its around the house if there's anything. I need you to know. You can do the same if there's anything I need to know tomorrow. Uh, Andrew. Brings me back to when we were in high school. Haha, <laughs> fine. But you're the one who's gonna clean them up. I'm good. Your mother's sewing machine's still working. Do you think Bernard would mind if I practice with it? I've always wanted to make a cute little sweater for Timmy. Timmy fell down the well. Bad joke is bad. Yeah, the, the, the two things connect. Okay. I guess the sun is moving in to Andrew's old room. Timmy's stairs. Okay. T t Timmy's giving grandfather a heart attack. Feels strange that my grandson is moving into my son's room. Hope little Timmy likes it here. I guess I guessed right on that house map. Grandpa's house map by Timmy Thorne. My new room! Multi- Grandpa's study. Grandpa's bedroom. Living room. Power source. Okay. 
guest room, kitchen, dining room. Didn't label the bathroom, though. Do I not keep it? Am I supposed to memorize that? Because it ain't happening. Sorry this room is still a mess. Your grandson specifically told us that he would unpack his stuff himself when he returns from his, his school camping trip. Cool. Nice. I can use this it as a flashlight. Will it have the length and distance to go with being a flashlight? Do I have to keep charging it? Most readable items can be read using the tablet. I feel the way this fell over is Timmy... Andrew used this in um, high school. Must have fallen when the door closed. No, because the way that it was stuck into that radiator feels like uh, Timmy didn't want anybody in his room during his masturbation sessions. I mean, I said nothing. Reread the map, house math. Is, yeah, is this an apple? Dad's old room. Where's the door came from? Yeah. Can help you stay in the dark, but not for too long. Oh. Okay. Well, let me go down. Kate said I might have broken it during the fall. I can fix it with the nipper in my study. N n nipper? I, by the way, this is a Korean studio. At least that's in the name of it. Is there nothing to turn the light on with? Okay, you're already freaking out. And I'm already stuck. I'm stuck! Chill. 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 Letter to Andrew. Andrew, I'm sorry it took so much away from you. I wrote this letter and letters after this, not in the hope of gaining your forgiveness, but to tell you how much I love you and your mother. To me, she was and still is the most beautiful and kindest person I've ever known. Your mother always had this calming presence that made you forget about the bad things happening around you. If she told you that everything is okay, you would believe her without a second drop of doubt. I can still remember the time I was under your mother's care in Vietnam. She was a nursing officer who was part of the first Cre South Korean medical team that came to help the U.S. in the war. When I got taken to the Korean field hospital after my injuries due to the chain of events. But it said Vietnam. What? Oh, Vietnam. First Korean medical. Okay, so she came from South Korea. Um got to field hospital after my injuries due to the chain of events. Your mother, being the only staff who could speak English, volunteered to be my caretaker. She could have sent me to a U.S. hospital, but she was concerned with the idea of me moving around in my condition. As such, your mother always thought of others first, even in a foreign land where death loomed for everyone, including her. Envelope. I mean, I am in an office. Pliers? Tool for cutting or peeling wires. Okay. Look at the lower left store dot. You know, this is, a, this is a pretty snazzy. This is pretty snazzy. I can't remember the code. Oh, good. I can't either. Electrical contractor's license. Electric thorn. Huh. Hi, how are you today, sir? Body that fell down the stairs. Nipper? Nip, nip, nip. Nip, nip, nip. Oh, 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 oh. Wires exposed. I need my hip. 
Yeah, do you want to get electrocuted? Just, uh, okay, okay, okay. Just stop while I can. Uh, come on. Oh, I'm supposed to hit. Come on. It doesn't... The thing is, with one of them white and the other one black uh, in that, it... Did you turn off the power before doing that? I feel like you just electrocuted yourself. We're all dead. Th this is the answer. Everyone's dead, including myself. I do love that there's a slight, um, like when I look away from that and then th that it takes a moment to focus in on Memento. Memento Mori! Forget nothing. I mean, uh, okay, there is a, okay. Diagnosis. Go find more pink pills. There we go. I mean, bitch, bitch better move. Also, why can't it ram this? The wooden ramp at the front door is in horrible condition, so I had to throw it away. I'll get a new one at the way here tomorrow. She needs to continue to hit things! Kate's moving plans. <sighs> Andrew moved our stuff to Bernard's place and settled in. Timmy starts three day school camp, uh, me go to go two day medical workshop at Hudson Hotel, Bernard's homecoming day, Andrew's 12 hour shift until next morning, bring Bernard home from the hospital after workshop, go to 12 hour night shift at 11 p.m., kill me now. Oh, yeah, I, I agree. After Timmy returns from school camp, have a big move-in party. Wait, it looks like there was a second. I mean, usually they have that little thing on the back that means that it's the ear, but it doesn't look like it. Ah, walker. Two different types. Go grow that there. Dinner is pretty piano. Calming a PTSD attack. Uh, take a deep breath. Practice deep breathing can help you combat anxiety. Distract yourself. Activities such as doing chores or reading books can help keep your mind off strong emotions. Mindfulness. Be in touch with movement. Be aware of what's happening around you. Seek social support, be a part of a support group led by a professional that can help reduce PTSD attacks. Turn on all the lights, make room as bright as possible. Don't look away from its face. It gets worse if you look away from face. It keeps coming back. G -g cool, okay. The opposite of um, a weeping angel, cool. I mean, actually, it, the same as a weeping angel. Excuse me. It's, it's, yeah, I, I figured that out a long time ago. Nothing in here I need? Huh. Apparently not. Ah! Uh, hi, I heard you like tank controls. No, well, guess what? You have a wheelchair. Tank controls! Woo! Flush the toilet, flush the toilet. Can I flush the toilet? That is the best answer that should exist. Also trying to, at least the bathroom lights are still working. The house is old. Yeah. I wonder how he dealt with this entire stuff before people moved back in. Anything that... Why 
Why is this done this way? Why? Why? I wonder if leaving the door open counts as a light for him not to freak out as much. It does not. I'm stuck, I'm stuck! Okay. Good that somebody got me back out. I'm stuck again, I'm stuck again! Ah! Going back over here real quick. Chill, chill dude, chill, chill, chill! I mean, he might have those kinds of things that are, like, uh... We'll make it together s s sometime. See? We made it! Everything's fine! won't open. Uh, there's another. A circuit breaker is busted and some electronics are out of power, including the opener for this door. I'm sure dad keeps a spare breaker somewhere. Found a spare in the kitchen. Good! I freak out when I go to the kitchen. Don't know why dad keeps it there, though. I use it to fix the breaker once I come back from work. Of course. Cool, cool, cool. Yep. At least he's respectful... Looks like an auto storage gadget for me. Maybe there's a manual for this thing. Alexa! I'm not going in there yet. Post it. I finally got the smart lights we talked about. Okay, the, that's what those are. We talked. Uh, yeah, the thing is with disability, it, it costs more for a lot of things. Just to, you know, be able to live a normal life. Well, as close as normal as possible. I installed it around the house, so please sync them with the new tablet. It would- I would if the tablet arrived on time. Update. It arrived while I was taking a nap before my night shift. I have to head out, so I'll have to do it if it has- Okay. Screwdriver. A handyman's best friend. Besides a dog. Smart light manual! Smart light! How to sync your smart light device with your- Smart- Device. Uh, the apps- Pop-up window will appear on your smart- Device, follow the instructions and sync. Cute lock code. Okay. Oh. Dear diary, it is burning outside. That's what that, you know. Uh, Snaps benefits only pay for food, really. You're always a smart lad who learned anything so quickly. It is one of your many characteristics that reminds me of your mother. In Vietnam, I asked her how she learned to speak English. She told me she made friends with the nursing officers from the nearby U.S. field hospital, which is quite amazing considering her deployment was just a year ago. And it's on fire! Thirsty for knowledge, she said she wanted to write in English too. I told her it would be natural Naturally, it would naturally improve just by reading a lot, but considering the circumstances, finding suitable reading material was difficult. After some thought, I promised to write her letters after my departure so she could use them for studying. A few days later, I was sent to a U.S. hospital where I was soon given a medical discharge. I went back to Sunny Ridge where I immediately got to keeping my promise. Come to think of it, writing those letters was more for myself than for her. There were scars I brought back home from the war, the kind that keeps you awake at night. For some reason, writing to your mother was the only thing that helped me cope with the living with them. That's why I kept on writing these letter those letters even though there weren't any replies. Proceeded to move back a few paces. Cool. Um
um, did it manage to, um, QR code save it? Or did it automatically? This is something. Thinking it's almost the same age as my mom. Him knowing what a fucking QR code is and how to do it. I, 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 I call doubts. I call absolute fucking doubts. The fact that he can use this uh, tablet so well, absolute doubts also. Oh, that's fun. Like, I, I still, like, I bought her a tablet. Uh, well, it was a very cheap tablet, but it was still a chap tablet. Looks like it's out of power. Hmm. Break the box. And she still doesn't use it because she doesn't completely understand how to do it. So I need to sit down. Circuit breaker is broken. Shutting down the door. We need we spare in the kitchen. I'm. I hate! There's a god somewhere! And it's not with anybody who has a wheelchair in this, this space designed for non people. I mean, people with. <laughs> don't have wheelchairs. Like I said, disability sucks. Also, disability representation is awesome in this game. The fact that. Even though I, I hate it for trying to get around, but I mean. Oh god, the door closed on me. Oh no! Oh no! I actually have to turn around. Uh, oh, I can move around in one space. I can turn in one space. I can turn on a dime. I'm sorry, I forgot about that. I am a good wheelchair user. Shut up. Sh shut up. If I stay right here, how close is it? I mean, not me. It says it's in the kitchen. Is it one of the drawers? Fix this. I need to remove post it. Ah, the kitchen light isn't working again. I really hope it's not a chewed off wire this time. No, it's the apocalypse. Um. I heard you're good at mini games. No! Let me give you all of them then. Y you choking there, sir? You good? You choking there, sir? Having a bit of problem there, sir? Oh. Hi. It tells me to look it on the face. You good? Look at its face. Oh, focus, I must fix this first. Well, it keeps telling me to look at its face. Am I supposed to time it correctly? Is, is that what I'm supposed to do? Fuck, I start all the way from the beginning. Okay. Like I said, I'm good at mini games for Five Nights and Fretting this. I need to... I love that it... I know, right? <laughs> it 
So, um, nice hole you have there. Want to stick anything in it? All right, I have to put this up. Good that it taught me how to do this beforehand. You know, why don't I shine my flashlight on it? Just, j just saying. Can I... For my own sanity, can I... No, I can't. But then again, it is an exposed wire that did not fucking electrocute me. I mean, I don't know much about electronics. Don't get me wrong. But doing that without turning off the breaker first. Also, I love how stationary, like, I can't use my um, wheelchair to absolutely push these chairs out of the way. I know that's game design here. Is there food in there? I am easily distracted. Oh, right, I have to stand up. Nope. I know, let's stick... <laughs> let's stick the fork into the socket. That'll change everything. Is that what I need? Yep. That'll save me a lot of time in this game. Oh, scissors. Can I bring the scissors with me to stab something, please? Or put in a hole that seems to be missing? You know, something inside that hole? Also, there's a TARDIS there. I just noticed that. So, so that's where you got the idea of the kind of whip, we, weeping angel. Idea. You know, I, I repeat, as much as I'm bragging on this, I'm kind of having fun. Kinda. And I must get stuck. It's behind me, isn't it? I deserve to die at this. I suck at this! <laughs> are you having a- are you having a seizure there? Y you good, sir? I know, but in his delusion, he wants to go upstairs. I mean, into the attic for some strange reason, so I'm stuck. I can't move. 
You're having problems, you know. Maybe you should... Say, so maybe you should do something about that gas. Forgive me. What? I'm just worried about, like, their intestines. I mean, what kind of thing are they... Like, seriously, you might need to see an intestinal doctor about that. Seriously. Like, all seriousness. Side. All right, um...